hi guys welcome back to my channel today is exciting but i'm getting ready right now because i woke up late so i need to leave soon <laughs> Over the next couple days, I'm going to be doing some fun things for back to school because as you guys know, it is my senior year and as of yesterday, I finished my summer class. I was, or I took three summer classes and I finished the last one as of yesterday. So cheers to being a senior in college. Yeah! Yay! Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to be doing a few things that are like just kind of fun make myself feel better and today is day one I'm gonna be doing eyelashes I have not gotten my eyelashes done by eyelashes I mean eyelash extension I haven't got them done since I was a senior in high school which was like three years ago three to four years ago I guess kind of crazy it's been a very long time I, got, I used to get them in high school all the time I took them off for a little bit then I got them put back on for prom and graduation and then I just had them taken off because I didn't feel like dealing with them anymore. Actually, I ripped them off and that was not a good idea at all. A friend of mine that I met on Instagram, more of a, a blogger, if you will, and she goes and gets her eyelashes done at this place. And I used to go to Amazing Lash, which no hate to Amazing Lash, but like, they're just really not it. Yeah, I, they're just really not it. Like, simple as that. When I thought about getting lashes again, I wanted to go to like, I don't know, a different kind of place <laughs> than amazing lash this place was offering like a back to school deal for anyone that booked month or whatever before school started so i was like yeah let's do it yeah that is what i'm doing today if you are excited for this video go ahead and give this video a thumbs up right now and while you're down there giving this video a nice thumbs up, go ahead and subscribe if you are not subscribed already to my channel. And you can join my little family here on YouTube. It's a great time over here. We have a lot of fun. Go follow me on Instagram as well because I am more active like day to day obviously on Instagram than I am here on YouTube. It's a little easier to throw a story up on Instagram than it is to edit a whole video so yeah go follow me on instagram go check me out that's about it i'm going to finish curling my hair and get back to you guys i'm done getting ready i'm gonna show you guys my outfit and then i have to go because my eyelash place is a little far away and i want to stop and get some breakfast so i'm wearing this like lime green crop top i got this from nordstrom it was their bp section it's kind of like a longer crop top which I like because, I don't know, sometimes when they're like way shorter, they don't look that great on me, but. And then these shorts are my shorts that I wear all the time. These are Abercrombie. Um, I think these are the, I don't remember. I think these are the boyfriend. The Curvy Love Boyfriend Mid-Rise, I think is what these are from Abercrombie. I love these, they're my favorite shorts ever. I wear them like all the time in the summer. Best purchase I've ever made in jean shorts. So get these if you need some new jean shorts. Then my Air Force Ones, of course, because I'm just basic like that. These earrings are from Amazon, by the way, because I didn't say that earlier. But these are Amazon. And then I'm going to wear my 1999 necklace that I always wear, and it's from Amazon. So there you go. So I'll see you guys on the way to the eyelash place. All right, guys. Oh, I look so dark right now in the, the lighting. This lighting is not great. Um, I'm going to try to film a little bit on inside, but this is what my eyelashes look like nothing on them no makeup because you're not supposed to wear makeup to the appointment here we go this is what my eyelashes look like before I'm, I'm just getting like a classic set they're not gonna be like super dramatic um but hopefully hopefully they're noticeable we'll see but i'm about to go in i'm gonna try to film stuff in there i don't know if i will the lash place is called h aesthetics lash bar um i'll put their name on the screen uh because they're so sweet they actually gave me a discount code for you guys to use and i'll put that on the screen as well and you can get 20 percent off your first set or first service because they do like brow stuff too but anyways the lighting's terrible right now so i'm gonna go in my appointment's at nine and it is 8 48 so yeah i'm so excited i'll show you guys after hi guys i am done with my eyelashes i've been done with my eyelashes i'm like obsessed with uh brushing them though so like for real anyways i got them done they're like very full uh well actually they're not that full sorry the lighting kind of sucks butthole let me move this hold on guys there we go okay that's better that's way better anyways i'm done with got my eyelashes done this is what they look like they're so cute i did not vlog while i was in 
the eyelash place. Let me turn my air conditioner off. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Even though I'm gonna die because it's so hot. I was gonna vlog inside, but then I didn't really feel like it. Because, like, I know you guys don't know what I'm talking about. But, like, when you vlog, sometimes you really just don't want to. Like, in certain, like, you know, I don't know. I wanted to just, like, go and enjoy it. So I did. I had a great time. The girl that did my lashes, name is Sierra. Well, I'll put the lash place on the screen right here. Um, so you guys can go follow them on Instagram because they are so cute and they were all so nice. Like I met the owner today. She was so sweet. And I have a friend that works for them and she has their social media and stuff. So she's the one that kind of got me to go there and she hooked me up with a discount code for you guys. Like I said earlier, so I'll put that on the screen again. And yeah, you can go follow them on Instagram. If you're in the Houston area, you should definitely check them out because they have so many different services. They do eyebrows too, different like eyelash tinting and eyelash perms and things like that. Yeah, I got the hybrid set if you're wondering. And I really like them. Like not gonna lie, when I first when I first looked, I was like, oh my gosh, these are so dramatic. I don't know. Like, you know, because I'm used to getting like really natural lashes. I'm getting used to them and I'm really liking them. They're really fun. That's about it. And then I went to the mall because I was right by the mall and I'm, I never get to go to the mall. Um, I went to Buckle and found the cutest pants ever. I'll insert the clip right here. I took a clip while I was in the dressing room. But they didn't fit me. They were like, well, they did. But they are really tight. And yeah, we all know how it is when you buy tight jeans. You think they look cute when you're standing up because they do because they fit you all good. But then like you go to sit down and they're too tight and you can't even eat or anything. So yeah, I figured I shouldn't get them and they didn't have my size. So I'm definitely going to order them online because they were so cute. And not to mention, I totally forgot how cute Buckle's clothes are. Like why are people sleeping on Buckle? Maybe you're not, but I am. And I won't be doing that because their stuff is so freaking cute. I used to shop there all the time and I quit and I shouldn't have because their stuff is really cute. I think that's my bottom eyelash. What the fuck? There's like, it's literally stuck. I don't understand. That sucks. Anyways, now that I've been messing with my eyelashes, now I'm gonna go to Salada and get some lunch because I'm hungry. Okay guys, I'm back home. It is a lot later. It's now 7.20, I think. And I just ate some dinner and been talking to my mom for a little bit. Oh, I was going to update you guys on what I've been up to. A few weeks ago, actually, I bought a new car. I made a whole video about it. You can go watch it if you want. And within like three days after getting a new car, I guess I had ran over like a nail or something. Took it to discount tire and they repaired it. They like patched it for me and they are like, yeah, no big deal. All good. It's been like a few weeks later when I got in my car this morning, it was like super low. So I called my dad. I was like, what should I do? And he was like, just take it to discount, have him fix it. So I go take it in and they told me that I needed a new tire because there was a gash in my tire that was like this big. And then there was three nails, three nails in my tire. So that was a little inconvenient. And then I didn't know what to do because here's the thing with cars. I don't handle cars ever. Like the cars I've driven, my dad handles them because he works for a car dealership and he manages a body shop. So literally any problem I have, I just give it to my dad. <laughs> So long story short, I ended up getting two new tires and that was a very frustrating and I didn't know that was going to have to happen and I don't like doing things rushed and it's really not a big deal at all, but I got two new tires so hopefully I won't have that problem again. But I was really stressed out and then I just came home and have been chilling, talking to my mom for a little bit, but I wanted to sit down and talk to you guys, show you what I got today because I did go shopping. I did go to Nordstrom and I got this top it's this is from their um bp brand which is like they're a little like kind of cheaper but it's a nordstrom brand this one is like this like really pretty olive green the fit of this shirt on me like i don't know i think it's like looks flattering on me so i kind of like it instead of just like a normal baggy t-shirt but this like green color is just so cute and was reminding me of fall and i feel like it makes my eyes pop what do you think I wish they had other colors. They had like white and black and I don't need any more black shirts and I didn't want white because I don't typically wear white. Then this I didn't get today. I got this yesterday. I have been wanting this blanket for so long. Literally so 
long. This is the Casa Luna brand from Target. Ever since I knew I was moving out, I've been eyeing this brand for like bedding. And I just never knew what color I wanted. I think you guys have seen my bedroom at my apartment, but it's like just very plain and like no color. It's just like cream and white and black. And I wanted to add a color and, and like some texture. And so I couldn't think of anything better than this blanket. And I did do an Instagram poll to ask you guys what color to get. The rust or like a sage green. And sage green won. But I bought rust because I like the rust color a lot. Hi Hazel. Do you like the blankie? It's going to be so cute in my bedroom. I, I'm thinking about like this color with like the throw pillows black and white or like a black and cream kind of like a boho look i don't know i'm not really sure but so that's all i have for now um i am gonna try to clean my room because i have not done that and i need to it's so bad i've been wanting to clean it for so long now and i just keep putting it off so i think i'm finally gonna clean my room that's probably it for today so i will see you in the morning when i get ready to go get my hair done hello guys it's the next day it is thursday and i am headed to get my hair done i'm so so excited but i wanted to show you guys my outfit before i leave so here's my outfit today um i'm wearing this sweater vest that i actually got from target so this is what it looks like i'm trying to see if you can see the color kind of like orangey brown um i thought it was so cute and you could still wear it in summer because it's like light like it's not thick but I also can't wait to wear it in the like fall and winter with like a turtleneck under it. I think it's going to be so cute. These shorts are Abercrombie. I absolutely love these and the ones I showed yesterday. These are actually the 90s curvy love mom shorts, I think, is what these are. But these are awesome. Like I love these shorts. Abercrombie is my favorite shorts ever and I've always struggled with finding shorts that I like. And Abercrombie did a perfect job with these shorts, so... If you struggle with finding shorts that fit your or fit your waist and also fit your thighs and you don't want your butt to be like hanging out of the shorts all the time, like the length on these are so nice. Yeah, go ahead and get these and get the curvy love. The curvy love is the best. So, so that is my outfit for today. I think it's so cute. Oh, and then my shoes are from um, Marshalls. They're kind of like Steve Madden dupes. Yeah, Target sells some similar, but these are from Marshalls. So wearing my $19.99 necklace per usual. And then my earrings are just like random little earrings. I don't even know where they're from. This is my outfit for today. I love it. I think it's so, so cute. Yeah, now I'm going to go. Starbucks, where can I get started for you? Can I get a venti vanilla sweet cream cold brew with light ice? And then can I also do the egg white and roasted red pepper bites? You got it. What else? And that'll be it. 985 we'll see you up here thank, thank you thank you of course i had to get some starbucks i never skip my opportunity to get my starbucks before a hair appointment i don't really i mean i was gonna say i don't really need it but like i probably should because i'm kind of like addicted to caffeine so if i don't have enough of it i get a headache my appointment is in like 20 minutes of course i got the cold brew i swear starbucks like runs through my veins I can't I can't get away from it it's so good egg white bites these are really yummy like I when I first got them I was like no that's gross the texture's gross but now I've eaten them so many times like I'm getting a headache right now it's probably because I haven't eaten anything I need to like um, get the recipe and make these at home I know I tried but it, it just wasn't the same <laughs> It wasn't as good at all. I don't know what I'm doing to my hair. If you're watching this video right now, I want you to comment down below what you think I should do. Comment down below. Or comment down below what you think I'm going to do. Because I just really don't know. Do it. Comment down below right now. <laughs> if you comment down below. I don't know. Never mind. Comment down below right now. Let me know what you think I'm going to do to my hair. Because I still don't know. I'm going to eat my egg bites for my appointment. And then I'm going to go in. And you guys will see. Hi guys, it is way, 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 way later. It is now 8.14 and 
I've been home for a while, but I've just been hanging out. But this is what my hair looks like. I hope you can like see. I feel like it like it looks different to me, but I don't know if it looks that different to you guys. But, and the curls have kind of fallen out because I was laying on it. But basically we did a full head of highlights before. I had only done like half head of highlights. Then we added low lights as well and shadow root like always. And then um, my bright pieces in the front. Face framing. Love it. So yeah, looks great. I knew it was. I, I like literally just tell Kara what I'm thinking and she reads my mind somehow and works her magic. I don't understand how she does it. She's actually a magician. So yeah, she's great. I love her. I will never go five months without getting my hair done again. <laughs> it's a no for me i love it it's so it's exactly what i wanted like more dimension but still keep the light because i think the light is like works on me look at my dog guys passed out i'm eating a crumble cookie right now my parents have been buying these like every week and when i come home i always eat them they're so good they are opening one in college station though so that's dangerous yeah i just wanted to say that last night i decided to rearrange my room at midnight so my mirror that used to it used to be on the other side of my room. Now it's right there. And my, like, hair and makeup thing. That's besides the point. I'm so random right now. So that is it for today's video, I think. I'm just, like, this whole video is, like, a vlog of me spoiling myself for senior year. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. I love having new people on my channel. It's so fun. And it's just like more people to interact with. So go ahead and subscribe if you have not subscribed already. And turn on your post notifications so that you never miss one of my videos. Lots of college vlogs are coming your way. <laughs> so that is it for today's video. And I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.